Let's get back there. And so it is done. You have overcome each trial that I set before you. You have shown faith and wisdom and perseverance. Therefore, I judge you worthy, and I say unto you, come to the gates of eternity, where you shall be granted everlasting life. Oh man, thanks God, it's such an honor. But before we go, I did collect some stars. Ah, oh, I'm like too short. Okay, whatever. I don't care, I got everlasting Come life, what matters? Child. Eternity awaits. I could, of course, attempt to go back to the tower again, but now nah, I'm good. Let's go! <laughs> no, come back, child. You're going the wrong way. That's not eternity. You're going back to puzzle hell. <laughs> Is this eternity? The computer? It is pretty grand over here. Type eternalize to proceed towards eternal life. Sure, whatever. Rejoice, my child, as you leave this world behind. For all that you accomplished shall be passed on to your generations. In this land, they shall thrive, and you shall be remembered as the beloved servant what? of Elohim. And so death shall have no dominion over you. Be well, my child. Be at peace. Is the independence check failed because I used, uh, like tips or hints alright well oh whoops I guess guess we're still going maybe Guess we'll let the game go on and then I'll I'll talk. Oh, it's the get the game restarted. Well, I'll Behold, no 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 we're done with that. Well, I'll give I'll give my final thoughts. So I don't know if I would say it's a bad game. It kind of feels like it overstayed its welcome by a good bit. And I know there's other endings from what I understand. And maybe you would find out more information or there's joke endings, something like that. There obviously are like references and Easter eggs within the game, but I, I don't have any want to go back and get the other endings, you know? Like that's the problem I'm at right now is while I could go back and maybe learn more or maybe get a different ending, I don't want to because I got bored of the game. I got very bored and kind of tired, and I just wanted to get the ending, if that makes sense. So, not a bad game, it just felt a little disappointing. Like, if it was maybe half of the length, maybe it would have been better? I'm not even entirely sure if that's true. But that's kind of the feeling I'm getting? I don't know. Um, I am kind of curious about those other endings. Not enough to play through them, but enough to look into it. Like, I know there's Easter eggs, as you can see right here. Um, and I almost wonder if it'd be interesting just to look and see, like, some kind of... If I could find pictures and stuff that kind of explained the, uh, some of the Easter eggs and the other endings. So I'm just going to watch this video and I'm, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to end up just uh, like summarizing the endings, I guess. And if you want to, just search the Talos Principle All Endings and you can watch the same video. Alright, so the second ending that they called Messenger here, it looks to be the... Uh, it looks to be kind of like the guys that gave you tips that you're turning into one of them. 
is what it looks like. Well, if nothing else, that one seems more epic. Kind of cool. I wonder what gets you that one. Maybe it's if you get all the stars. I don't know. I'm not even looking what, like, what leads you to get these endings. Alright, so the tower ending is probably what I would call the true ending. It seems to kind of wrap up everything, so to speak. It, uh... It ends with you, I presume, go up, going up to the tower, and you end up at a terminal. You talk to the guy that you have been talking to the whole game, and um, I guess you end up basically agreeing with him. You end up combining with him, and he almost seems like he's a consciousness of sorts, or like a um, like that little voice in the back of your head, as they say. And. What happens is you transfer your consciousness, or whatever you'd call that as a robot, into the real world, out of the simulation, which appears the simulation was expressly for this purpose, apparently. You get transferred into a body that looks very similar, if probably exactly, like the one you've been playing the game through, but you wake up inside of the research facility, the Nomadics research facility that they were talking about through the game. And, uh, and that one felt like the best ending I've seen thus far. I liked it. I'm gonna watch the rest. I think there's a joke ending in here as well, so I'm sure it'll be interesting. It also shows a lot more credits. So you can tell this is like the real ending, so to speak. You also appear to be walking closer and closer to an open outside door. Excuse the double music, the game is running in the background. But yeah, it looks like you're thrown into the ruins of civilization. There presumably stuff happens after that, I guess. You go around and do robot things. Alright, well, that was interesting. Thanks to slassification for this. Um, to my understanding, there are a lot of Easter eggs and stuff throughout the game. We found we ran into a couple, but I really did not find many of them. So anyway. I think, unless anyone has anything they'd specifically like me to do, I think that's going to be the, the the end for the Talos principle for us. Talos? Talos? Something. Uh, it was okay. It wasn't bad. I just felt like it was too long. And I have no interest in pursuing the other endings. I was thinking about this while I was watching that video. The difference between... Um, obviously, there's a lot of differences, but the difference between a game like Nier or near Automata, which I'll avoid spoilers here, is that there's multiple endings in those games, and to get the full story, you have to play through all the endings. Same thing as this game, I, I would say. The difference is that, you know, I think it's the pacing and the general fact that I want to see the other endings in near whereas I... Uh, don't really... I have no interest in seeing the other endings. It's not a very good comparison, but it's just something I thought about. So anyway, let me know what you guys think. Um, we'll probably be doing a new series at some point soon. I have a couple ideas, but I haven't quite gotten around to uh, coming up with exactly which one we're going to do. So just give me a couple days and we'll have a new series we're going to be doing. But thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye!